How's it going guys? We're going to go ahead and take a look at 360 security antivirus for your Android phone. Now this antivirus here, I'm pretty surprised with it. It actually has 4.6 um, out of 5 star rating. 100 million downloads. It's a junk cleaner and mobile security app, so it's 2-in-1 with a antivirus engine inside. If we look, When we look at the... Um, Reviews here, easy to use, useful, best antivirus, good security, best cleaner app. Looks like people like it, so we're going to go ahead and install it and take a look at it. Of course, you know, all the crazy permissions and all these apps. So we're going to go ahead and download it. This might take a while. All right, it's downloaded. Now let's go ahead and open it. Let's take a look at it. All right. So I've never looked at this before, so we're both reviewing it in real time together. So it looks like I can boost my phone by 39%. Let's hit the boost button and see what it does. Boosting. Hit the turbo. Hmm. Battery time extended by 1.3 hours. Wow. I, hope, I wonder if it's true, though. Hmm. Cool. And now it's trying to make me install a junk cleaner program, but no. We're going to go back. Cool. So it looks like we got the boost done. Let's, take a, let's check out this clean tab here and see what we can do. Junk file is found. Let's click on the scan button. Don't allow. Don't know how long this is going to take. Hmm. Let's clean 1.2 gigs. Hope it doesn't delete a lot of stuff. Um. Looks like it's making me go here. I don't know why it's making me go like this. YouTube's junk. Let's delete that. Gallery junk. Now I don't want to delete photos because my girlfriend and I like to take a lot of photos, guys. All right. Hmm. Let's, let's click on clean again here. See what it does. Okay, it's done. Finish. It cleaned 1.21 gigs, guys. Really? Dang. I'm starting to like this program. All right. Let's go back. It's asking me to rate it. I'm just going to exit that. So I'm starting to. I like this program. It's pretty cool. Let's go to antivirus. Never scanned. Uh, let's click on scan and see what it does. Scanning for malware. It goes pretty fast compared to a computer scan. And if, if you guys notice, I'm starting to do now um, smartphone videos because a lot of us, come on, let's face it, computers are starting to become obsolete. Even laptops are. We do everything now on our phones and tablets. So the, my uh, YouTube channel, Luis Tutorial TV, now is modernizing. I'm going to start making a lot of videos on uh, phones and tablets now. So be on a lookout for more videos like that. This is just one of many antivirus videos. My goal, guys, is to make a review on every antivirus app that's on the market. I know it might take a while, but uh, right now we're doing 360 security. Next we're going to do NQ security and then Kaspersky, so on and so forth. But so far, man, I like this 360. It's, it's, it's user-friendly. The big buttons are there, you know, for people that like to press buttons. So it's nothing like you would see in an antivirus for a computer. This one's more um, user friendly. So I like that about it. The scan is kind of slowed down now. What I'm going to do is pause the video here. And I'll continue recording when it hits 100%, guys. So it hasn't hit 100% yet, but as you notice, there's already four issues found on here. All right, guys. Looks like it finished the scan and we have one privacy risk here 
one system vulnerability fraudulent messaging broadcast the heck is that this may allow malware to send you fake text messages whoa okay what is this app lock what is that okay so I'm just looking here to see what is all I'm just gonna hit repair all cool so it looks like our the phone is good cool so that's basically all this phone has all this uh, I mean this app has guys is boost clean and antivirus now up here there's more features you can get like uh, Apple lock lock against snoopers let's try that real quick lock wonder what it does oh draw and lock pattern let's do a very easy one one step left to make app lock function properly on your device please authorize access uh, you gotta confirm access for it to do this you know I'm not gonna confirm it this is just a review guys so I really don't want to go through and uh, turn on all that so we got privacy now uh, turned on there now this payment what the heck is payment here authorized needed with your authorization payment protection will be enabled so if you need to pay on your phone you can do it you can do this oh so it'll protect Amazon eBay stuff like that cool I'm telling it I authorize it. Select 360 security experience, blah 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 blah. Confirm. I gotta turn this on. I think that's how you turn that on, guys. Alright. So just follow the instru the the what I'm doing now, and I think you guys should be good. Protect for one day. Cool. Now everything's protected. So that's how you do it, guys. That's how you completely protect your phone right there. Let's see what is. Let's see what this is. 360 box. I think that's where you store your stuff. That's just another app you can use. Let's look at the menu here. See what we can do. There's app lock, full scan of your SD card, phone cooler. What is that? 19 overheated apps. That's cool. Let's cool them down. Let's see what that does, guys. Enable. Let's see what it does. Please find and enable 360 security. Got it. Didn't we already do that? So you're going to have to enable a lot of security things so that 360 can actually go on your phone and be able to change things around. All right, guys. So just follow the instructions there. I think you got to go into your settings and do that. There's also a game boost, space cleaner, which we did use, an app manager, find my phone. That sounds pretty interesting. You got to activate your account. Got to use a Google account to activate. All right, guys. So I give 360 Security a good review. I like the way it has these um, tabs in the in the top. Just makes it very user friendly. Boost, clean, and antivirus. And then these big buttons in the middle just makes it very user friendly. It works very well. I could already tell my phone's a lot faster now. And it's a must, guys. After a while, your phone does get full of junk. And sometimes you do get some malware in there. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to be making a lot more um, Android security videos. Hopefully soon I'll do iPhones too. But for now, just Androids. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you soon in one of my next videos.